Hello, good evening. Good evening, Professor. How are you today? I'm fine, are you? Very well, very cold today. You know, it's, I don't know where you are, but here is very cold. Here also, right? Yeah, and it's kind of windy as well. Yes. Okay. Good night. Good evening, how are you? Okay, welcome everybody to the English class. We're going to wait just one more minute to check if everybody else is going to come into the class. Okay, so we are going to start. Uh, welcome to the English class. This is the last class of this week. Uh, so I hope you have a you had a wonderful day. And um, well, the first question is always about platform. Um, how is everything going with the platform? Are you working on that one? Have you finished uh, section one or maybe two? Uh, any comments about that one? Is everything fine? Yeah, everything is okay. Very well, very well. I'm happy to hear that the platform is going very well. So yesterday we were also discussing some things, right? Do you remember what we were checking yesterday? Irregular verbs. Very good. Irregular we're verbs. We were verbs. practicing and we were... In the past. Yeah, in the simple past tense. That's good. So we are going to start with a little practice on that one. Uh, let's see how it goes. Okay, there we go. Uh, hold on a second. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? Sorry, I'm late. <laughs> ah, don't worry. We're here for you. Okay, so um, let me just make this a little bit bigger. Okay, so this is a little exercise. It's going to be very easy, actually. Uh, we are going to, as you see there in the example on the top, I'm going to move this. Um, so uh, the ones that has the check, there will be uh, affirmative, and the ones with the X, the red X, are going to be negative. In this case, the verb that we will use is help. And, well, the solution is I helped my brother and the other one is, I didn't help my sister. Remember the pronunciation, didn't. Okay, some people, they say sometimes didn't. Pero no hay una E ahí en medio. So it's didn't. That is important, okay? Didn't. didn't. So uh, the next one, it says, let's see, I'm going to move this. Okay, this one, it says, wash. He wash. So who is going to be the affirmative? He washed, he washed the clothes. He washed the clothes. He washed the clothes. Very good. He Wash. washed the clothes. And the negative? He, he didn't, didn't, he didn't wash, wash the, the, car. Car. the car. Good. He didn't wash the car. Remember, the wash is in present. And what happens if I want to convert that into a question? How is it going to be? Did he, did he wash the wash car? The car? He washed at the car. Nice. Okay, then the next one says study and my sister. How is going to be the affirmative? My sister studied. My, my sister studied chemistry. Study. Study. Very good. Chemistry. You know what is chemistry? Chemistry. Chemica. Uh, chemical. Yeah. Yeah. It's when you play with the elements and create many things. How is going to be that one into a question? Did my sister study chemistry? Very good. Did my sister study chemistry? Nice. And the negative, how is it going to be? 
she did she didn't didn't study, study, study history. Very good. So let's go to the next one. You and visit. Who's going to be the first one? You visited your friends. You visited your friends. Very good. You visited your friends. And the negative? You, you didn't, didn't visit, your visit your family. Your family. Yes. You didn't visit your family. Good. How is going to be that one into a question? Did you, Did you visit, visit, your, visit your, family? your family? Good. Did you visit your family? Remember that you can also answer uh, in that kind of questions. You can also answer in a short way, right? Yes, I did. No, I didn't. The next one is arrive in the train. So who's going to be the affirmative? Train arrived at 10 past 6. The train arrived at 10 past 6. Good. Right. And the negative? It didn't it arrive didn't at 6 o'clock. Very nice. Very good. So the other one is play in we. Who's going to be? We played football. We played, we football. played football. football. Good. And the negative? We didn't, we didn't play, play the play goal. Play. Nice. Let's go to the next one. There are just a few more. Okay. So this one says, Nero lived in Rome and Nero didn't live in Brazil. And then there is like a question. So this is exactly what we were doing. So one you, who's going to be the affirmative? You wanted, you wanted some fruit. Good. You wanted some fruit. And the negative? You didn't want, you you didn't didn't want it. Meat. You didn't want me. And the question? Did, Did you, you want, want fish? 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 Did you want fish? Nice. Good. The next one is die and the man. So who's going to be the affirmative? The man died in 2005. Good. And the negative? The man didn't die in winter. didn't die in winter. I can see the, 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 the last part of the, the, the compliment. Uh, hasta donde puede ver? Hasta... Uh, in two, <laughs> the man in... Really? Y los demás también lo ven así. Este, yo creo que es por no. la cámara. Solamente tiene que minimizar la cámara o quitarla de ese lado, pasarla para el otro lado. Sí, en, está, en la, en la parte está, de arriba, está, está la, desde la computadora. La cámara, ¿eh? Ajá. Ajá. Parte en, de arriba, yo lo veo bien. Parte de arriba. Hay tres cuadritos. Hay uno, una línea, un cuadro y después hay dos cuadritos, uno encima de otro. Dele al, a la línea. Cabal en la esquinita, pero donde están todas las cámaras. Donde se miran todas las imágenes de nosotros. No sé si usted lo mira por ahí, Roxana. Sí. Eso, eso es lo que cuadro. no la deja ver, ¿verdad? Ajá. Ajá. Estamos ahí varios. Mostrar video en cuadrícula. Ah, pues. Ajá. O, o solo presiona el primero. Entonces ahí solamente lo va a minimizar una cámara. Ajá, Mostrar exacto. video pequeño. Mire dónde está usted, mira su imagen, mira su imagen. Intercambiar pantalla con... con si vea, vea el azul, no sé cuál de todos es el que tiene azul. Sí, el, el azul es... Está el que tiene la cuadrícula, muchos, el que tiene dos, el que tiene uno o el chiquito. Tiene dos y el de azul. Va, entonces le ah, puede pues, dar... Ah, pues, al chiquito. Ajá. Dele al chiquito, chiquito y se le, va, ajá, se, le van a, se le van a desaparecer ya las... Ah, oh, sí. Yes. Eh, las cámaras y ahí va a poder ver ya toda la pantalla. Ok, thank you. <laughs> Good. <laughs> ok, so, um, how's going to be the question for die and the man? Did the man die in London? Died. Died. Mm -hmm. Ok, so it's going to be. Did the man die in London? The man died in 2005. Oh, you are in the affirmative. So, but we are right now in the question. So, did the oh, man the die in London? Did the man die in London? That is it. Very good. And the next one says stay and he. How is going to be the affirmative? He, he stayed, stayed alone. alone. He stayed alone. He stayed alone. And the negative? He, he didn't, didn't stay, stay, with, stay with, me. with me. Very good. And what about the question? Did he, Did stay, he stay with, with you? Me? 
very Thank good. you. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> okay. The next one is push and she. So who's going to be the affirmative? Pushed. Pushed. She pushed. She pushed, she pushed the, the machine. machine. No, the machine. <laughs> she pushed. The, machine. the pronunciation is correct. The pushed. Push. Yeah, it's like a D. Push. Like a T? Push. Push. So it's going to be push. she pushed the machine. And the other one, the negative. She, she didn't, didn't push, push the, wheel. 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 the wheel. The wheel. The wheel. The wheel. 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 You know what is wheel, right? Yes. No, I don't know. Wheel, what is, wheel is like in the car. When the you car. have yeah. four wheels for you to, to have a car. Four wheel for, for each car. Thank you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so the, well, the next one is uh, a question. How is going to be the question? Did she push the button? Did she push the button? Did she push the button? The button. 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 Very good. And the last one, tidy and then. It's a regular bird. That is a regular bird, yeah. Regular? It's regular. Tiny. They tiny. They tie up their room. They tie They tie it. They tie They tie it. They tie it up the room. They tie it up the room. And then the negative. They didn't tie it up the room. They tie up the kitchen. The kitchen. Okay. And the question. Did they tie it up the office? Did they tie it? Did they tie up the office? Very good. Tidy is something like very similar to clean and organized. So everything is nice. Okay. Good, good. Do you have any question about this? No, any question, Professor? Yeah, I know that is very easy for you. So like <laughs> okay, so let's do a, a little bit more of exercise. And then we're going to practice in the way that you want to practice. I know. So we're going to check this one. Uh, who's going to be the first one? Uh, let's say in uh, affirmative. Jane watched a film. Jane watched a film. Watched. Watched. It's watched. like a T, right? Yeah, that no. is like a, something like a T. Watch it. Watch. And the next one, he? He, a negative. he carried, carried a, he carried didn't carry a box. box. He didn't carry a box. Very good. The next one, uh, how's it going to be? They helped their father. They helped their father. father. Nice. And the next one in the film as well? Yeah. And mm -hmm. Amy mm -hmm. swapped things. Swapped things. Swapped. 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 Do you, knew, uh, do you know what is swap? No. no. Okay, no, swap is... To, uh -huh. Good. It's like to interchange. Interchange. Change. In this case, things. So imagine that you have a flower and I have a stone and oh. I say, let's swap. And you give me yours and I give you mine. So that is swap. Okay. Good, right. good. The next one, how's it going to be? Affirmative. I talked I, to Andrew. I talked to Andrew. I talked to Andrew. I talked to Andrew. Good. Next one. Susan danced with Peter. Susan danced with Peter. Good. The next one. The boys. The boys the tried, boys basketball. tried basketball. 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 Very good. Right. And uh, the next one. We, we planned, planned, a planned a trip. Planned a trip. Planned, it, planned, it. planned a trip. We planned a trip. The next. Planned or planted. Planned. No, plant. 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 With plant. D. It's like a D. Like a D. D. Plant. Plant. Okay. The plant next the drip. one. Uh, who's going to be? She washed her hair. She washed her hair. She washed her hair. Washed her hair. Good. Washed. Uh, the last one there? Their car, the car stopped, stopped at the traffic light. The traffic, light. traffic lights. Good. Mm -hmm. Car stopped. Nice. And this is the last part. So who's going to be the number one on the yellow one? 
Children dressed children quickly. Children dressed. Dressed. Quickly. dressed. Quickly. Yeah, dressed quickly. Nice. Number two. I, I help, help my mother, my mother in, the in the kitchen. Okay. And uh, number three. We, we walked, 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 in walked in the park. In the park. Oh. Nice. Number four. They, they washed, washed their, their clothes, clothes in the bathroom. In the bathroom. Good. Number five. We watched, we watched inter 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 interesting film. Inter 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 Perfect. Mm. Number six. It's it's students work worked in the, in the garden. garden. Mm. Work. Nice. Number seven. We played play 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 basketball. Number eight. The girls, the girls keep very, very fast. fast. For two. <laughs> okay, twice. So number nine. It, it, it rains, 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 rains a lot. It rains a lot. Good. And number 10. Harry is Harry is down, the down the hill. Down the hill. Um, ski, okay. Ski. Okay, ski. my friends. Um, ski. 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 Ski is when you go to the mountains and you ski in, in the snow. Ah, right. In the snow. Yeah. That is snow. And do you know what is skip? Skip. Like, uh, no. It's like, it's like jump, sneaked out, something like that. Very good. Mm. Okay. Ahora vamos a hacer una actividad muy interesante. We are going to stop this thing. Let's see how many I wear. Good. Um, this is what we are going to do. We are going to practice um, the verbs in past. Everybody look at me like, what is going to do? <laughs> <laughs> we are going to do this. We are going to tell a story. Everybody together. I'm going to start. Okay. I'm going to start the story. And then uh, I will say just a, a little bit of the story. And then I'm going to say the name of the next person that is going to continue. For example, I will say there was a girl that was looking for a stone. And imagine that I say, Roxana, continue. She is going to continue with the story, a line or two lines. And then Roxana is going to say, ah, uh, Carlos, continue. And then we are going to check how is going to be the end of the story. Everything in past, please. Are you ready? Yes. Okay. Don't be afraid. It's going to be fun. I'm not sure. <laughs> so, uh, if you have questions, this is the moment. Do you have questions about the activity? Preguntas de lo que vamos a hacer. I got it, but... How many points? The all sentences that we're doing is like continue about the same story it should or be the can same be story. a different no it okay. should be the same story okay okay thank you it should be the same story and maybe we're going to do like three times vamos a hacer como tres rondas por cada uno y vamos a ver cómo termina okay y me pueden decir a mí también o sea todos vamos a participar o sea que de repente regresa a mí y vamos vamos a ver ah uh, bueno vamos a esperar a la compañera se acaba de conectar hello hello Mirna how are you Hello, teacher. How are you? I'm very well. Welcome to the English class. Thank you. Happy to see you. Okay, happy to see you too. Uh, we are going to do an activity today since you remember that we were talking yesterday about simple past tense and we were checking about regular and irregular verbs. What we are going to do right now is that we are going to tell a story all together. I'm going to start. And okay. Then I'm going to say the name of the next person and that person is going to say the part of the story. And then uh, it's going to say the name of the next, okay? So we're going to see how it's going to be, okay? Okay. Very well. So I'm going to start. Uh, let me think. Um, once upon a time, there was a beautiful girl that had red hair. Oli. Why me? Anybody can be. You can do it. Don't worry. Okay. Um, once upon a time, I drill um, a high rail. It's beautiful. 
is beautiful um, so much. It was beautiful. It was beautiful. Uh -huh. Simple pass. We're going to use only simple pass. Okay. It was beautiful. And together is, is with, with Eric. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> that is a good one. Okay. Who's next? Um, Mirna. Mirna. Ya que vas entrando, Mirna. <laughs> that is the welcome. Yeah, Mirna. No ni cómo continuar la historia. That is the warm up. <laughs> well, there is not a warm up. You can continue in any way. So she says that this uh, beautiful woman with red hair, uh, she met Eric, that is probably me. And you continue, right? Mm, she fall in love about Eric? With Eric. Uh -huh, with Eric. Okay. And... I don't know that more. <laughs> okay, you can continue. You can say who's next. Andrea, Alejandra. <laughs> um, um, the girl dances with with Felix. Okay, with Felix, good. Okay, uh, so. So I went to visit my family uh, yesterday. Okay. okay. Um, we changed the story, but that's good. Who's next? Yeah. Karen. Karen. Okay. Um, the girl uh, was in love with Eric. Okay. But she danced with the Felix, right? Yeah, that's well, the story. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know well, why. Please so. don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> and so um, after uh, she danced dancing with Felix, uh, she realized that he that she uh, missed uh, Felix. Okay. Uh, and no, mixed. Eric, uh, Eric. Okay. So uh, she thought about do something, and the next is uh, Roxana. Okay, Roxana. Hey, decide, Eric and the, the girl <laughs> decide. Uh, went to the decided. Mm -hmm. Went to the. Uh, Theater? Okay, to the movie theater, okay. <laughs> so they decided to go to the movie theater. Who's next? Um, Antonio. Antonio. Okay. Um, and Eric wanted to get married with her. Okay, and I like it. <laughs> the next is Yosemite. Okay. Hi. After oh. they get married, maybe they went to the honeymoon. Okay. They went to the Bahamas. Okay. And after they came back, they had so many children. Many children. And <laughs> Jose. <laughs> Okay, um, uh, I saw a lot of children and I was playing football, so I invite their their children to play with me. Okay, we're friends all together. That's good. Who's next? Josue. Um, uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Samuel. Samuel. No entendí el contexto. Ah, ok. Estamos diciendo solo una historia. Usted va escuchando y va agregando lo que usted crea conveniente. Simple past. That's what we are practicing. Simple past tense. If you don't get the story, vamos a skip y voy a continuar yo. Y luego usted se une. So, um, uh, Josué, who was playing with the children, soccer, and uh, they remembered the English class they had long time ago with Karen, Roxana, Oli, Andrea, and everybody. 
and they decided to get together and to make a party. So next one is going to be Carlos. Uh, I invite uh, uh, to see the Eagle be the champion this weekend. Okay, so it's going to be the weekend. <laughs> and who's next? Um, Antonio. Antonio again. You're famous. Sorry, sorry, but I I couldn't uh, hear it very well to uh, my friend. Said, yeah, he said that uh, we were going to get together and go to to the final, to the stadium, to watch the game, something like that. Okay. So after that, uh, everybody went to a cinema. Okay. The so... next one is... It... The next one is um, Rivas Rodriguez. Okay, Celia. Okay, um, she decided that, uh, oh, sorry, she didn't go to the cinema because um, she was sick. Ah, oh, poor baby, okay. Who's next? Um, Felix, Felix, Felix. Felix. I don't know who, Felix yeah. Amaya, Felix. Mm -hmm. Okay. And um, um, when when now uh, sorry when now uh, I meet Karen and Eric, they knew a lot of English, and that why. Um, I seen a seen up. Okay, very good. So we met together. Uh, we have uh, go ahead, please. I'm sorry. Uh, yeah, and okay. okay, that is it. So we 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 will speak. In, uh, we were speaking in English, right? In that party that we were after uh, the match. So who's next? Uh, <laughs> Olympia. Holly. No, no sé por qué tenía esa impresión. Okay. Um, together, together was, um, no, together, eh, uh, party, no, ¿cómo se dice? Fuimos a una fiesta. We went to a party. We went to party, um, um, party party. Um, eh, I am very funny. I very was. Uh -huh. I was very funny. Uh, I very happy. Okay. So much. Okay. And okay, the next one is going to finish the story. Who's going to be the next one? Okay. Um. Uh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Samuel. Samuel, you finish the story. After, after that, we went with and we watched the game. Uh, finish. <laughs> okay. Okay, that is it. Maybe we can finish that. So we watch the game. I, I, you want to see that game, right? I can see. <laughs> okay, my friends. So this was interesting because it's not only uh, to be creative, but also that you need to pay attention to what other people are saying. Can you see that if you don't say the words correctly, sometimes it's difficult, right? To say, what, what did he say? So it's very important to use grammar correctly pronunciation also correctly so everybody can understand you that is very important it's not only to speak and that's it is uh, to do it correctly so um, remember I mean here in El Salvador probably we understand each other 
But if you go to other country, I hope you go uh, actually, uh, you are going to see that it's very different. I mean, they speak in a different way. If you go to Canada, if you go to the US, if you go to Australia, if you go to England, it's English everywhere, but it's different. It's different. So it's very important for you to use the correct words, the correct pronunciation, intonation as well. Okay. As you see, when I'm speaking, I don't speak like, yes, you have to do it. Or, uh, no, right. You need to create a path, a pattern. You go up sometimes and you go down sometimes. So that is going to help the other person that is with you uh, understand you better, the idea that you want to say. Okay. So that was the purpose of this little exercise. And right now we're going to do a different practice. I want you to speak. So this is what we're going to do. I'm going to give you five minutes for you to um, write, let's say, six questions, okay? Six questions about anything that you would like to ask a classmate. And then we are going to uh, go in rooms, in pairs, and we are going to ask the questions. And when we come back, we are going to provide the information, okay? It's clear what we're going to do. Uh, do you have questions? ¿Se entiende ahí la actividad? How many questions do you do you say? Five, six questions. Five, six. Yeah. So I'm gonna. I'm sorry. Ah, I'm sorry. So I'm gonna can give I, you. Go ahead. Can I use double H question? You can do. Uh, you can create double H questions. Yeah, in past, simple past. But any question, um, you can use just no questions. You can use information questions, and then uh, we are going to go in rooms. Okay. So I'm going to give you five minutes for you to write uh, the questions and then we're going to go into the rooms like five or six more minutes and then we will come back, okay? I have a question. Go ahead. This, I mean, these questions that we are doing, it's going to be like in the same way like past or is anything? We can uh, ask everything. I mean, you can, you can ask it's about not depends. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm sorry. Go ahead. It's not depends about the the topic about this the past tense. Actually, just... yes. We are going okay. to use simple past tense questions. So you can ask, for example, what did you do last weekend? Um, did you? I don't know anything. What did you? Where did you go? Um, uh, did you dance sometime last year? Anything that you may want in simple past. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Any other question before the activity? Okay, uh, five minutes. If you have questions, you can ask me, okay? And then we're gonna go into the rooms.
finish. Very well. Has everybody finished? Okay, uh, so I'm going to create the rooms and ask the questions to your classmates and then we are going to come back so you can tell what you have investigated about that one. Okay, are you ready? Yes. Here we go. Teacher? Yes? Um, I have I have a message in my screen. Yeah, you need to enter there. Enter. You, yeah, enter and you are going to be with Mirna. Uh, creating oh, I need a session de grupo pequeño. Yes, yes, please. Teacher solo dice que hay solo tres participantes. Pero puede entrar, no. No, sí, estoy dentro, pero no veo a los demás. Usted es Andrea, ¿verdad? Sí, no, siento que aquí ¿Sí? dice que no ha entrado. Eh, tiene un mensajito donde dice entrar a la sesión y ahí pues tendría que darle para entrar, porque sí, aquí en el, en el sistema me parece que no ha entrado. Josué tampoco ha entrado. Mm. Mm. Me voy a salir y me voy a volver a meter. Ok. Hi, teacher. Hello. ¿Usted eh, no había ¿Usted nadie no? en el grupo. Eh, sí, estoy viendo ahorita que falta alguien más. Lo voy a poner con otro grupo, déjenme ver. Y pueden ah, entonces, okay. ok. Bueno, ok, perfecto. Ah, aquí hay alguien solo, aquí lo vamos a mover. Ah, vamos a mover. ok, perfecto. Vaya, si, si gusta puede tratar de entrar. A ver, a ver si le sale. Good. Andrea. Vamos a ver si sí, no tengo a nadie más. La voy a mover a usted ahora a otro grupo. A ver. Aquí. Vale, ahí le va a salir el mensaje y solo entra a la sesión, a la mini sesión. Uh, where did you study at college? I was studying Bachillerato General, teacher, yeah. como se dice. College uh, or high school? Yeah, uh, you can I... say um, a bachelor. I have a bachelor degree. Ah, okay. Bachelor degree. Yeah. I was studying bachelor, bachelor degree. You can say I had, I had a bachelor degree. Where Where did you study at college? Ah, uh, where is the uh, question? Oh, nice, good, thank uh, you. High school. High school. Yeah, high school. <laughs> so where it was? I was a study. I studied. I, I studied. At Adeon Siwense okay. in Cojutepeque. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. And next, did you sing in karaoke? Mm. Sing. Sing. Uh, 
think. Start thinking. Uh, yeah, I think it's. Okay. What did you do on December 31? I eat a lot. All right. You drink a um, lot or you, you drank a lot? No, no, drank, no. Drink soda. Ah, did okay. That should be, did you drink? Okay, okay. Okay, so I uh, ask ask me, Carlos. Okay, este. Um, what what are the the ways uh, to use the paths simple? What is the best way to use the past simple? Yeah. Well, the best way to use past simple is um, well, telling stories in the past. For example, yesterday I went to the cinema or something like that. Hi, teacher. Hi, teacher. <laughs> it was difficult. <laughs> <laughs> really? Why do you feel that? Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I am. <I'm... laughs> Let's wait for the other people to come back. Okay, so um, how did you feel this activity? That's the first question. I think it's better when uh, small groups because everybody can talk each other because when it's like the whole group, I think it doesn't understand. It's very hard to understand and it's, and it's very hard to learn too. Okay. I very think well. so. <laughs> Yeah, this is a very good practice because we are able to have a, a conversation, a, a nice conversation with a person, right? Um, do you believe it was easy, was difficult? Somebody was telling me that it was kind of difficult. It was difficult for me. Yeah, sometimes... Uh, it was difficult for me. <laughs> yeah, to, to use the language and to make the other person understand, as I was telling you, right? Okay, so let's see. Uh, who wants to tell first about your... A classmate, what did you learn? I I learned to Cecilia. Okay, go okay. ahead. Tell me about Cecilia. 
Cecilia, I, how do you say, yo pregunté? I asked. I asked, I asked her, what made you happy? And he said, she said, eh, sleep, he, she loves sleep. Okay, that's a nice hobby. <laughs> and I asked, eh, when did you start learning English? And he said, in 20, in 2015. Ah, oh, 2015, good. Yes. And the other question, I, where did you have dinner yesterday? And she, she said me, uh, ate pupusas. Okay, good. <laughs> y, y, it's finished. Okay, because very good. I I can the uh, I can oh finish. sorry okay. I finish <laughs> okay very nice thank you very much Mauricio who wants to be next I want to be the next please go ahead Karen. okay I learn learned mm -hmm. about Olympia okay uh, she um, she used to to play with her, her brother. Okay. When uh, she was uh, a kid, okay. and I learned uh, also that uh, she uh, she's a very responsible woman because she didn't uh, visit her family uh, last holidays okay. because of the coronavirus. Okay. And also, uh, she uh, her fa her, f her favorite meal. Uh, when she was uh, a kid, uh, was the soup. Okay. And also, um, let's see. Ah, she enjoyed to go to school in her adolescence. Okay. And um, uh, last week, uh, she told me that uh, she stayed stayed at home. Very well. That's all. Mm -hmm. Thank you. It was very, very good. Congratulations. Thank you. So, who wants to be next? Yeah. Okay, go ahead, Felix. I uh, learned uh, that I need more practice. Okay. Uh, thank to Joseph Smith for the advice. And thank you, uh, uh, and you, teacher. Okay, it's a pleasure. Uh, so you didn't ask any questions to Justin? I guess not. Okay, who wants to be next? Maybe me. <laughs> okay, please go ahead. I learned about Felix. Okay. Uh, I help you a little more for the vocabulary. Okay. And I... I did the questions like, uh, when did you go to visit uh, your family? Okay. And he answered, uh, he is not, he didn't see them like a year ago. Okay. And, and asked them, asked him, mm -hmm. uh, where did you go on vacation last year? Okay. And he said he went to the beach. Okay. I, I I think Mahawal or something like that. I don't remember exactly the, the name right. of the beach. All right. And I asked about some um, a series like did you watch did you did you watch the House of Paper the last season and he did, he said he didn't because he doesn't have um, Netflix. Okay. So. <laughs> I think that's the only thing that we can ask because, because the time was too short. And I think he's a nice, nice boy and, and he's doing a lot of job to learn English. Very good. Thank you very much. I really appreciate your words. Just me. Uh, who wants to be next? Oh, 
Okay, I choose. Uh, let's see, Roxana. Okay. Uh, I have problem because I can hear my, I can hear my classmate. Oh, okay. I, no, I can hear my classmate. Okay. Because they, she had a problem with her phone. Oh, right. And, but I remember about the question I asked uh, to her. Mm -hmm. Is uh, how, uh, where, where you born? And she said, uh, I was born in, in Santa Ana, okay. I remember. And I asked her about the, how was your day? And she said, uh, it was, uh, well, she says to me, All right. and I don't remember anything more because uh, be, uh, for the phone, for the yeah, phone. the technical issues. Yeah. Okay. Thank you, Roxana. Okay. okay. Now let's go with um, Mirna. Hello, teacher. Hello. Hi. <laughs> Question to Roxana, and she told me, um, uh, I answered, what did you do the last weekend? And she told me uh, she went to the church and the supermarket and she helped to her mother. Okay. And also I question who was her best friend in the high school? And she told me it was Jessica. Okay. And what play did you did she like to play when she was shy and she told me softball and i only question that because the time was short okay. yeah okay thank you thanks so now we're going to listen to jose aristides okay uh, i spoke spoke yeah with uh, let me see, uh, Samuel. All right. With Samuel, I I ask her, ask him the um, where did you go in your last last vacation, and and he answer that he went to the beach. Okay. And and then I I ask here the did you play soccer? Did you play soccer? And he answered that uh, he he didn't he didn't like uh, soccer. Okay. And um, only that. Okay. Thank you very much. It was very good. <laughs> Let's listen now to um, Carlos. Hola, hola. Hello. Perdón, tenía apagado el micrófono. Oh, don't worry. Eh, eh, ask it, eh, uh, Antonio, eh, what is the best eh, way and to learn English better? And eh, what are the ways to use the past simple? Uh, and Antonio uh, asked a uh, Alejandro, parece que Alejandro, okay. Andrea, no sé. Eh, eh, the, um, no recuerdo, <laughs> no recuerdo. All right. So you don't have more information. That is fine. Don't worry. Thank you very much. So uh, who else is missing? Let's see. Um, Cecilia. <laughs> Sorry. Um, I asked to Mauricio Vasquez, and he said that he can walk. He walked in the park uh, last weekend, okay. and also he can dance. And he didn't go to the beach yesterday. And the last one was. Um, that he didn't want to get married. Yeah. <laughs> All right, that's, that's good. 
<laughs> thank you, thank you. Cecilia. Yeah. Okay, now Oli. <laughs> okay, um, <laughs> the husband, um, daddy, um, he, um, uh, he was serie, um, the mother is YouTube and Netflix. Okay. Uh, the Google movie, um, not, uh, this pandemic. Okay. Because uh, of the pandemic. Because of the pandemic. That was it. Okay, thank you very much, Oli. And let's okay. see, Andrea. Um, I asked um, Antonio, okay. um, did you have a bed when you was a child? And he tell me, uh, yes, uh, he have many uh, cats and dogs. Okay. Okay. Uh, is there anybody missing? I guess Antonio, did you did you did it already? Yes. Uh, well, I asked to Andrea. Well, she told me that she didn't drink uh, alcohol in, in December 31. She drank uh, a lot of soda. Okay. And uh, Carlos told me that her day, he, his day was very hard, I think, for his work. That's all. Okay. Very well, thank you. Okay, my friends, um, this was a nice activity because as you can see, sometimes it's not the same uh, just to be in the class than just go ahead and speak with somebody else's. We need to continue practicing. Since we are in intermediate, we need to pay attention on what we are saying, the way that we say words, pronunciation, intonation, and uh, it's a good practice. I mean, uh, we are going to continue doing this. Sometimes we're going to do it in front of the class so we can um, help each other that is very important and then uh, also if you want to practice I mean in the chat we can we can talk there we can uh, speak things there uh, writings we can do many other things but maybe this is the most important thing because it's where we practice speaking speaking is very important yeah. so um, let's continue doing that one uh, we are going to continue doing this activity and other activities so we can speak a little bit more and if you have questions, if you want to do something, uh, you can chat with me directly also, uh, and I will be there for you, okay? Teacher, I have a, a question. Go ahead, please. Uh, but, but it's about the platform. Okay. And I, I work in the morning, I worked in the section three. Okay. But it's... Uh, uh, but they, they, uh, I want to, I want to know about the exam. Okay. Uh, there, there is a, a day for the exam or is, it's about your progress, your own progress. Well, you can finish everything. Actually, Oli, she was telling me today that she finished all the platform already. All platform. Yeah, and then she comes to the class. Uh, my recommendation is for you to go side by side uh, with the platform and the classes. But there is not a specific time for that one. But we are going to do the midterm test review um, uh, next week. So on the second week, at the end on Thursday, we are going to check uh, the midterm test. So that's why sometimes we go to the platform and check if you have problems, if you understood everything, if there are things, because that is the progress in the platform is the one that is going to give you uh, the certificate, that one, and to come to class, right? Those two things are the most important. Um, but of course, you can move on, you can advance, you can do the midterm test if you want. That is not a problem. We are going to review it. And then we're going to check the final test, the 
last Wednesday, not Thursday, but Wednesday. So on uh, Thursday, there is the final class. We're going to do practice and some other activities. So, but you can, you can continue on your own way, on your own path. That is no problem. And if you have questions, you can also, even if we don't have, uh, we don't have, we haven't seen the topic in class, you can ask me questions and of course I will help you on that. Thanks. Okay, you're welcome. Any other question? Any other? I will continue that... work. Definitely. Uh, yes, uh, we need to just practice a little bit more, understand the grammar. You are doing a very good job. Maybe we can, we have to speak a little bit more. That's the only thing, uh, but we're going to do it, okay? And uh, if you don't have any other question, my friends, it was a pleasure. I hope you have a fantastic weekend because tomorrow we don't have class. But if you need something, you can chat with me tomorrow, Saturday, Sundays, not at midnight, please. Uh, and we can continue helping you out. Okay. So okay. it was a pleasure. Mm -hmm. Have a good night and uh, good night. Good night, good night, good night teacher. teacher. Good night. 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 Good night.